guys, it's Troy from Troy's Movies. Today, here with the Aeropostale New York shirt. Always a pleasure wearing that, but you know what's also a pleasure? Playing Mario 3, because today we are doing just that. We're playing Super Mario Brothers 3. We are in the uh, second world. I believe we have the uh, warp whistle, right? Yes, we do have the warp whistle, which is pretty cool. So, let me go do the uh, airship level real quick. Well, let me turn down. Jenga can hear me. Let me go turn down the volume real quick. There we go. You guys, guys can probably hear me now. So, um, we're in the, uh, mushroom house while I move this out of the way. Oh yeah, Tanuki suit, let's go. That's gonna be helpful. I know you're out there, funny monkey jokes. Welcome to the FMJ, welcome to the uh, Mario 3 video. Well, I meant to take a power up in there, but we're going, we're going without. I, I didn't mean to jump. Oh. We use a, uh, awesome. Oh, I thought I would, would jump on that. Hi. How did I do that? Hi. Ah, you funny monkey jokes get out of here you you just you you ruined my airship okay but can you close the door for that extra stop for okay, a I'll go. thanks i said close the door but whatever We are on the airship. We're just trying to beat that. Then we can get to world three, finish that, use that warp whistle, head to world seven, and we'll almost be done with the game. I totally forgot about the warp whistles that are in world one. So you're just gonna have to excuse me on those, but... Yes, a mushroom! Are we getting close to the boss? I didn't use the warp whistle there. Ah, hey! That bad timing, though! It's all RNG, and I hate... Well, it's not RNG, it's... Mainly, like... I don't know, like, uh... Skill? Because I don't have that. I'm sorry. <coughs> Cannonball, though. I gotta dodge that. Oi! How how was I supposed to see that coming? <clears throat> I got zero Mario's. 
You know what? I can get it powered up later on. I can get the mushroom. So, uh... <coughs> Phew! That was close. Wait for the cannonball. Now let's head over to all the way to the right. Jump. Make sure to jump there. Jump out of this cannon. Jump over that! <coughs> How did I do that? Get the mushroom! Oh! How close was that? It's always the problem. We can do it. It's easy, but... Oh, and, and it stays there. That's nice. So whatever we get here... I'll take the middle box. Fire flower, let's go! I believe that allows you to take an extra two hits. Let's use it right now. <coughs> Plus, I can get the mushroom after that, so if I do take a hit, I'll be able to get a fire flower after that. <laughs> that, too, for the boss. Mm. Like I said, I'm really feeling confident about this one. Plus, the fireballs will be helpful for the rocket wrenches. Can't do anything about the bullet bills unless I, like, get a star, but... How did I do that? How again did I do that? I don't know how I did that, but I'm glad I did. However I did that, I'm glad I did it. I don't have the fire flower, but I do have mushroom status, so... Now there's only two of them. So I can take an extra hit here if I need to. But it looks like we are going to be heading down to the boss at, uh, how long we've been going? Seven minutes. I believe he only takes one more hit. Yes! That's in Japanese, so I don't know what it says. But, uh, yeah. Oh, she gave me the little Kiju clap, so I can skip a level. That's actually pretty epic. Now we're here in the, I believe it's the water world, 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 a three. Like I said, I'm not going to use the warp whistle right now because I feel like it could be useful to skip way harder worlds. And as I say that, I die. But, uh, like I said, by the way, skipping, like, three worlds would be more useful than skipping... Well, actually, I would have to do world four, too, because five, six, seven to get to world seven, so... By the way, I actually played this level in the GBA remake that my grandma has. She has the GBA remake of this game, and I actually played this level. So n that's, that's why I know that those things are, like, bad. It's not my first time playing this level, actually. It's my first time playing Mario 3, actually. Not the remake, but... Do I want to go for that, that power-up? Is that even a power-up? I didn't even check. 
You know what? I'm gonna waste a life just to see if that... Actually, no. Uh, on my next, like, continue, I'm gonna waste a life to see if that actually has a... Wait, can I just cheese it by going down here? Yo, that was so useful! Let me go turn it down just a teensy bit. But, like, seriously. That was, like, so... Wait, can you go through that this uh, brick wall here? No, you can't, sadly. Or go up through there, so you have to swim back up. But we do get the mushroom, which is nice. Like I said, this world shouldn't give us too much difficulty. Ugh. Like I said, too much difficulty. A little bit of difficulty, you know? Has to be there. But let's grab these coins. Doesn't hurt to collect a coin. Wait, what if we go through here? No, that doesn't do anything. So it's just this, it's just like a scene setter pipe. Yes! So that's how you get that. No! Come back! Yes! This is almost like an open world Mario level. You can go like literally wherever, whenever. I mean obviously you wanna get try to get to the end of the stage, but it's almost like an open world Mario level, and I love that. Wait, is this the end pipe? Yes! Yeah! We just beat 3-1 11 minutes into the video. We are making some good progress. Let's go to World 2. Or uh, Level 2. Wait, can we just go into the... Oh, wait, I thought... I didn't notice there were cheat cubes there. But we can probably just cheese the level. Wow, that just got glitchy. What's this do? Okay, so there was literally no reason to do that. <laughs> At first I thought we could maybe use that to like skip a level, but it turns out you can't do that. So, uh... You can do that when you beat the fortress, though. So, uh, yeah. Let's head on over to level two. I believe you, like, maybe you could go underwater if you were, like, a gamer god, but I'm not, so... At least that's what they're calling elite gamers gamer gods. I don't really consider them, like, that good, but... I mean, it's your opinion. No! How, wait, how did it fall through the... No! Is it recording? Yes. Jump. And luckily you stay in this world. You don't have to do it all at once. Yes! Now that's what you call an epic ga a la epic gamer. Is it- is this literally just like a ride the thing level? Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's a you die level. Alright, we do have to do level one again. But luckily now that I know about this secret path, it's gonna be super easy. And now I do have the Lukichu clouds, so I can technically skip this level. But I want to, like, skip one of the levels in, like, World 8. Because that's going to be, like, so hard. Unless you still have a P-Wing. Then it will be, like, so easy. Take a hit there. Go down here. Hurry up here. Hurry up, Mario! Go! <laughs> Wait, what's this? Is this like a hidden exit? 
What is this like for decoration? We can see the bubbles, okay? We don't. Oh, I almost had it. Now I don't think I can get the mushroom here anymore. Okay, that was dangerous. Ay! Get away from me, Blooba! What if I go down here? Oh, there's no blocks. Maybe one of them has a uh, power-up inside. Let's see. One of you want to be a good note block and give me, like, a mushroom or a fire flower or a tanuki suit or something? No, you want to kill me. That's fine, too. Everything's okay. Maybe if you just swim near the top of the water, you'll get through it, no problem. But of course there has to be this super huge pipe blocking the way, yeah. Mario, I'm, I'm giving you some room to breathe here, buddy, but that's not gonna stay forever. And that was easy peasy. Star! Let's go, Star! Beep. Oh, with four lives, actually, that was pretty good. Ah, that epic gamer. I'm, I think I'm, like, dead already. Unless I can, like, <gasps> how did I save that? Like, seriously, how did I save that? A la epic game boy! <clears throat> the epic gamer. Boom, boom, boom. Grab this. Oh no, now I'm gonna die, now I'm gonna die, now I'm gonna die, now I'm gonna die, now I'm gonna die. I know, I know. You're there so I can't cheese the level, but come on. Being able to do that as a secret path would be so cool. And why do they go through the platform? That makes zero sense. Wait, can I use the parachute? Ah. Again, that makes zero sense. I'm. Well, I am underwater, but like. I hit his head. And again, why do they go through the platforms? How did I dodge that, and how did I get hit from that one? Can you not kill these guys? Can you seriously not kill these guys? Well, I killed him that time, so maybe, 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 maybe it's just like a timing thing. back to the beginning and get that uh that secret thing you blooper you you nasty piece of garbage i never want to see you ever again Next life, if, if we die here, next life, I am for sure 
grabbing this before I grab the other one. Because that, that nasty blooper though, that, 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 he's, he's just a pain. because we got five lives obviously and there's no way to get extra lives there so Gamer epic failure is what I call myself. Quite a bit far while I was swimming in one, two. All right, I just gotta take it slow. Well, the the platform kind of controls how you can move, but be careful is what I meant to say there. So you can defeat them, but not in the water? Wait, one second, I want to try something. I'm going to grab a fire flower, and I'm going to see if by hopping in the water... Fireballs don't kill it. Fireballs don't kill it. And of course it's insta-death. Insta I could get the frog suit and just swim all day in that water. Of course I die, thank you very much. I like the gamer. Okay, so we are basically, oh, how did I do that? How did I do that? How did I do that? How did I get hit from that of all things? Cheap cheeps, I do not want to see you ever again. Like I said, 3-1 isn't a big pain. What's a big pain is the next level, 3-2. I gotta remember to get this. There we go. Got past the blooper with this intact. Again, I don't need the power up for this level, but I need it for the next one. Although it is cool that you can actually shoot fireballs underwater. And you can kill the stupid bloopers that way. Dude, man, that, that has to be one of the greatest revelations in gaming history, that you can kill the stupid bloopers. 
I want to bring it into 3 2, see if you can do it with the cheap cheeps. Boom! We got that star. We are ready, guys. We are ready for level two. Now, when the cheap cheap's over there, beat him. Now I'm gonna try to kill these cheap cheeps. And if I lose my fire flower somehow, I got this one. Now this is easy living. Oh, now this is hard living. Now this is angry living. Now this is needs something to punch living. This is this is rage living, man. This is. And again, why does it go through the platform? The cheap cheeps are annoying in this level. They're so annoying. So my conclusion to my studies is you can kill the cheap cheats, but it doesn't really matter. I'm heading back for the other one. Ah! Wait, 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 what killed me under there? Are there like spikes under there? What has humanity created? Perfect. Jump. Grab it. Yes. Allows me to take one extra hit, but I don't think I need it. We're still alive, technically, but no, we're not. Stupid cheap cheeps. You always get in my way.
Yes! great place to end this episode so if you guys enjoyed it smack the like button make sure to subscribe so you don't miss the latest choice movies video and uh we'll see you in the next video bye